Bismillahir Rahman Rahim. So let's do some more examples related to counting principle. The questions could be related to basic counting principle or uh, maybe generalized counting principle. So the question says that a college planning committee consists of three freshmen, four sophomores, uh, five juniors, and two seniors. So you have actually one, two, three four categories a subcommittee of four consisting of one person from each class is to be chosen how many different subcommittees are possible so like you have to make a subcommittee in such a way that it will be consisted on four members okay and these four members will be in such a way that one person will be from each of these four classes like out of three these three freshmen you will find find out one person uh, choose one and out of these four you will pick one and out of these five you will select one and out of these two you will select one so let's say first first we are uh, selecting freshmen so in how many ways can i select uh, a person for this committee from this these freshmen so there are three so there are three possible outcomes uh, for a single person or in other words you can say that i can select that in three ways suppose let's say uh, this is freshman one freshman two freshman three so this can be selected this can be selected or this so in three ways i can select are there are three possible outcomes similarly then let's do the task two which is selecting uh, a person from sophomores definitely there are four possibilities so you will select so there will be four possibilities uh, then then you have five juniors so there will be five possible outcomes and then two so all you have to do is uh, this is really generalized counting principle just multiply them 3 12 the uh, 3 4 the 12 5 12 the 60 and then 2 120 so uh, there are 120 different subcommittees possible okay again we have got another question it says that how many different seven place license plates are possible if the first three places are to be occupied by letters and uh, the final four the final four by numbers so that's not a big deal so you you have to make a seven place license plate okay so there should be seven categories one two three four five and then this will be six and seven okay so let's say filling this first place is our task one so in how many ways can i perform this task so it says that first three places are to be occupied by letters so how many total letters are there there are 26 letters okay in english alphabet so out of 26 one can appear here so there are 26 possible outcomes for this similarly 26 here similarly 26 here so this was task one this was task two this was task three, task three task four is to select uh, you know a uh, you know number for this place because these four are to be selected as numbers so there are uh, zero one two three till nine these are total ten you know numbers so there are this task can be performed in 10 ways uh, there are 10 possible outcomes for this experiment 10 10 10 because they are to be selected as numbers so these are the total seven tasks and uh, uh, performing to them together in other words to to make such plate you need to perform these together so that means now you just need to consider is task 1 task 2 task 3 task 4 task 5 task 6 task 7 and then you just uh, 
apply the general counting principle which says that multiply all of these possible outcomes 26 into 26 into 26 into 10 into 10 into 10 you have to calculate this result by yourself here comes an interesting uh, question again it says that how many functions defined on n points are possible how many functions defined on n points are possible if each functional value is either 0 or 1 that's not a big deal to solve so how many points are there total these are n points let's say this is 1 2 3 4 5 blah blah this is n total n points are there now a function will be assigning each of these points a value and uh, it also says that functional value is either going to be 0 or going to be 1 so now let's say we are uh, performing this task 1 which is to assign functional value to 1 this point so there are two possibilities either it will be assigned with 0 or 1 so there are two possibilities suppose this task is performed now now on this if if it is getting 0 then uh, followed by this you will perform this it also has two possible outcomes 0 or 1 so for this also 2 for this also 2 each of these points will have functional values 2 either 0 or 1 like this 0 or 1 0 or 1 0 or 1 0 or 1 this way like this too so by using generalized counting principle and how many ways are uh, how many functions can be defined so you just multiply these two 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 till into 2 and these are n times that means 2 to the n so total 2 power n functions are possible okay so we have another interesting example this is basically related to one of the previous examples and it says that in the example of license plates uh, okay the seven uh, places license plates that we have right now done a few minutes back it says in that example how many license plates would be possible if repetition among letters or numbers were prohibited so now we had seven places okay one two three four five six and seven so now repetition is not allowed okay so let's say this is task one so how many and how many possible ways can i perform this task one of course 26 but now for this i will have 25 choices why because a letter which is assigned over here can, cannot repeat so there are 25 and because if these two are assigned and the task 2 and task 1 then these two letters can't repeat so there are 24 possibilities for this and uh, then of course numbers will start because uh, i don't remember how so yeah first three places were uh, first three places were to be filled by you know letters and these ones by numbers so uh, let's say this task has to be performed uh, by selecting numbers so there are 10 numbers out of those stone 10 anyone can be placed there and once this one is filled then there are nine choices for this because repetition is not allowed six and seven this is task five this is task six and this is task seven by generalized counting principle you just multiply these to get total number of license plates 10 9 8 7. Thank you.